Yeah, that's enough. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father, let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man, your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would a world condom. I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind them. Life is hard, I know. The challenges always go beat us home. Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown. And you're a good kid that need good leadership. Let me be your mentor, since your daddy don't teach you shit. Never let a man piss on your leg, son. Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son. Never fall in the escort business, that's bad religion. Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches. Never code switch, whether right or wrong. You're a black man even if it don't benefit your goals do some push-ups get some discipline don't cut them corners like your daddy did fuck what ozempic did don't pay to play with them brazilians get a gym membership understand no throwing rocks and hiding hands that's law don't be ashamed about who you with that's how he treats your moms don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again be sure five percent will comprehend but 95 is lost be proud of who you are your strength come from within a lot of superstars that's real but your daddy ain't one of them and you nothing like him you'll carry yourself as king can't understand me right now just play this when you 18. dear sandra your son got some habits i hope you don't undermine them especially with other girls that's hurt inside this climate you a woman so you know how it feels to be in alignment with emotions hoping a man can see you and not be blinded dear dennis you gave birth to a master manipulator even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor i think you should ask for more paper well, and first, more no paper and more uh, more paper i'm blaming you for all this gambling addictions psychopath intuition the man that like to play victim you raised a horrible fucking person the nerve of you dennis Sandra, sit down. What I'm about to say is heavy. Now listen. <clears throat> Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts. I think niggas like him should die. Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest they life. He hates black women, hypersexualize him with kinks of a nympho fetish. Grew facial hair because he understood being the beard just fit him better. He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance. And a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around him. And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking. Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose. I've been in this industry 12 years, I'ma tell y'all one little secret There's some weird shit going on and some of these artists be here to police it They be streamlining victims all inside of their home and calling them tender Then leak videos, set themselves to further push their agendas To any woman that be playing this music, know that you're playing your sister Or better yet, selling your niece to the weirdos, not the good ones Cat Williams said give you the truth, so I'ma get mines The embassy about to get raided too, it's only a matter of time Hey, Lil Bron, keep the family away Hey, Curry, keep the family away To anybody that embody the love for the kids Keep the family away They looking at you too if you standing by him Keep the family away I'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives Keep the family safe Dear baby girl I'm sorry that you're fine It's kind of hard because Um Drake makes a song and this guy, this guy is good at writing a text and Drake is good at making a song. It's kind of hard for me to keep track. I have to like listen. Active inside your like, world. He don't commit to much, but it's music and that's for forever. sure. He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs. Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own. Should be teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you. Or at your 11th birthday, singing poems with you. Instead, he being Turks, paying for sex and popping perks. Examples that you don't deserve. I want to tell you that you're loved, you're brave, you're kind, you got a gift to change the world and can change your father's mind, cause our children is the future, but he lives inside confusion, money's always been illusion, but that's the life he's used to, his father probably didn't claim him neither, history do repeats itself, sometimes it don't need a reason, but I would like to say it's not your fault that he's hiding another child, give him grace, this the reason I made Mr. Morale, so our babies like you can cope later, give you some confidence to go through something it's hope later i never want to hear you chasing man because it's felt behavior sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation you need to know that love is eternity and trumps all pain i tell you who your father is just play this song when it rains yes he's a hit maker songwriter superstar right and a fucking dead beat that should never say more life meet the grams
Dear Harbour, I know you probably thinking I wanted to crash your party. But truthfully, I don't have a hating bone in my body. It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game. But you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name. Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people? Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you. And I like to understand, cause your house was never for a home. 37, but you showing up as a seven year old. You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping and spending problems. Bad with money, horror house, soliciting women problems. Therapies are love start but i suggest some ayahuasca strip the ego from the bottom i try to empathize with you because i know that you ain't been through nothing crave entitlement but want to be like so bad that it's puzzling no dominance let's recap moments when you didn't fit in no secret handshakes with your friend no culture cachet to binge just disrespecting your mother identities on the fence don't know which family would love you the skin that you living in is compromised and personas can't channel your masculine even when standing next to a woman you a body shamer you go hide them baby mamas ain't you you embarrassed of them that's not right that ain't how mama raised us take that mask off i want to see what's under them achievements why well, believe you you never gave us nothing to oh, believe man, so in so much producing lane is unbelievable what was that you it's a lot of producing lane the guy is sometimes like above like you. morally you lied about your so coach rogers you lied harder. about your crew members they all pussy you lied on them i know they all got you in them you lied about your son you lied about your daughter huh you lied about them other kids that's out there hoping that you come you lied about the only artist that can offer you some help about religion. I mean, it just, guys, it, it's just like, it's like Kendrick's like whole bread and butter to, to that like in music. That's what he does. Dra like Drake posted on Instagram, nah, hold, can someone find my hidden daughter, please, and send her to me? These guys are in shambles, laughing emoji, laughing emoji, laughing emoji. Yeah, I mean, it's why I thought.